student, I mean, sophomore. So here we have a two trays. One, one has um, the, the fake corn syrup and the other one has the maple syrup, which is all natural. Um, the difference is that maple syrup is it's made from glucose um, and, and um, corn syrup is made from um, fructose. Fructose is a simple sugar. Uh, it's much more fat producing than, than glucose. Uh, a lot of the differences are in how they're made. Uh, corn syrup is, is made by milling corn to produce uh, cornstarch, then processing that cornstarch to yield corn syrup. Uh, it's it's very processed. Uh, when you, well, I'm, this is not true in every place, but here, and uh, when when we're dealing with maple syrup, the more you, uh, the more processed it is, the less um, natural and healthy it is. Uh, maple syrup, on the other hand, is not processed at all. There's a process of extraction, which um, um, includes um, getting the the sap from the maple trees. And boiling it to um, because all we want is just the sugar, not the water. And like 90, I think it's 98. Yeah, 98 yeah, percent of the sap is just water, and two percent is the sugar. So we just want to get the sugar. Um, another difference is that uh, the the corn syrup, the high fructose corn syrup, uh, it doesn't cause uh, insulin to um, release to be released in the body and or simulate the production of um, leptin which is a it's a key hormone that um, um, that controls the, the intake of energy and the expenditure um, of energy in the body so basically uh, once you take in the, the corn syrup the, the patchwork made um, corn syrup it, it just begins to uh, convert into fat, so you really have to use it in order for it to, to convert into energy, but not fat. Um, maple syrup, on the other hand, takes a lot more time for it to, to turn into fat. You have a lot more time to like exercise and all that, but the other one turns into fat immediately once it puts um, in your body. That's basically it.